Hey guys, Jaruti side. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to make a spring painting having a pair of rain or welly boots with a bunch of flowers inside. Through this spring illustration, I encourage you to have as much fun as you want and be creative with it. And trust me, this project is going to be something really fun and easy, so do give it a try. So here I have my sketch ready with me. You can pause it here and draw it first if you want. Now using beton wet technique, I added water inside one of the valley boot and adding color on top of that. You can pick any color you want your valley boots to be. Just remember whatever color you are picking, it should be a light wash of that color as we are going to add some darker tones of the same color on top of that. So what's the difference between light wash and the darker value? Basically to make light wash of any color, use more water and less of the color. Similarly, if you want darker tones of the same color, use less water and more color. Now adding darker tones and spreading it up. And let colors bleed into each other so it's completely okay if the colors blend so don't overwork and stop when you feel it's done now starting to repeat the same in the second valley boot by covering the whole area with orange color and adding shadows on top using some darker shades of orange Just remember as I'm adding darker tones here, so I'm using less water and more color. Okay. Here I'm quite happy with the shadows, highlights and some details. So let's move on to the more fun part of adding flowers and leaves. You can be creative here by picking up different kind of flowers. Uh, it can be roses, tulips or whatever you want them to be. And even the colors of the flowers can vary as per your choice or your palette. Also add fillers like some leaves and small flowers too to make it a big lush bouquet. And I'm also planning to make a tutorial soon on how to paint simple flowers like roses and tulips. So have a look on that. Okay, so have fun here and paint it on.
it looks good to me so here I stop I hope you like watching it if you create something using this tutorial do share with me in the comments below or you can tag me in my Instagram handle at the red quirky splash I usually share all the creations on my Instagram stories and if you like my videos don't forget to subscribe